Hello and welcome to another Withering Waves video. Today I'm gonna do some rolls on the Beginner's Choice banner. Yeah, over the past week I've uh, done quite a lot of exploration in this game and uh, saved up enough of these um, standard banner pulls and also Astride to get to 80 pulls here, which is enough to get a 5 star. And I wasn't really sure if it's a good idea um, to spend Astride on this banner instead of, you know, one of the limited banners, but I don't really plan on rolling for Qian or Yinlin anyway. Um, yeah, I kind of want to save for Jinxi, but I don't know when she's going to have a banner. Maybe it's going to be the very next banner, maybe it's still going to take a while, who knows. Um, but yeah, I think it's fine if I use some of my Astride for now. Um, to just, you know, get Verina, because I also want her, I heard she's pretty good, and, you know, I like her design. So I don't think there's any reason to not just get her, since I do have 80 pulls now. And also, I, I, I'm just hoping that I can maybe get some more copies of Sanwa, my main. That would be nice. And also maybe a 4-star sword, because, <laughs> yeah, I currently just have a 3-star weapon on her. And I think also on the other two, yeah. The three characters I've built so far and all of them have three star weapons because on my initial rolls on this account I didn't get any foster swords or gauntlets or pistols. So that's another reason why I think um, it might be good to do some pulls now instead of you know waiting any longer. But yeah with that being said I guess let's just jump right into the rolls. First temple here we go. Starting with purple as expected. Now please give me Sanwa. Or a usable Forster weapon. It is actually Sanwa. Oh my god, it was already worth it. No regrets. This is already a great session. Immediately got Sanwa. Heck yeah. That's exactly what I wanted to see here. C2, because, you know, I already got one constellation from the login event, and now this is gonna be the second one. What does this one do again? Stamina cost of heavy attack is reduced by 10, and when she casts a resonance skill, her anti-interruption is enhanced. That is actually really good, because I get interrupted way too much while I'm charging up my heavy attack to detonate um, the ice structures that she creates. So that's actually a really nice constellation, I like this. Oh yeah, let's activate it right away. There we go. Okay, this is already it's already been worth it. Oh, and um, I probably shouldn't call them constellations. Let's see what are they actually called in this game. Um, wave band. Okay, but saying W two doesn't sound as nice as saying uh, C two. <laughs> so maybe I'm just gonna continue calling them constellations. Anyway. Back to the rolls. That was just the first tempo out of eight. So let's see what we get on the rest of the pulls. Still purple. But that is fine. As long as we get, you know, a usable weapon again or Sanra. Still hasn't changed. Still the same targets. Raja? Okay. I don't really use her, but I guess that's fine. Tempo number three. Another Forster. Can we maybe get a weapon now? Got two characters. So far. Okay, is that gauntlets, I think? Yeah. Okay. Energy region. And when resonance skill is cast, restores 8 energy. Okay, so it's an energy region weapon. Don't know how good that is for Qianxing. Anyway, that was number 3, so... Now, number 4. We had 40 pity now. And still no 5 star. we got here? I think so far... Ah, okay, I think that's a claymore. 
yeah, I don't really have any claimer characters that I'm using currently. So that's whatever. I would have preferred a sword. Um, but yeah, that was the last pull again, right? So far, I think I got the four star on the tenth pull every single time, which is kind of bad. I would like to get more than one four star per temple, and maybe, you know, before the very last pull, because that's basically then the guaranteed four star. So, yeah, in that regard, it's actually kind of unlucky. But I really can't actually call it unlucky because of that sun wall right at the beginning. Anyway, 40 pulls so far, and now we finally have to dig into the asteroid, which, like I said, is fine. So, yeah, 50 pity now. The purple. Come on, give me something good. They're gonna be the last pull, isn't it? Yeah, looks like it. Okay, pistols, nice. Okay, got gauntlets and pistols now. Now we just need a sword. Attack. It's kind of good since Chishi is a DPS, right? When intro skill is cast, increases resonance skill damage bonus by 20% for 15 seconds. Yeah, that actually sounds pretty good for her. Okay. Nice. Then... 60 now. Yeah, I don't think we are getting an early 5 star today. But can we get an early 4 star for once, or is it gonna be on the last pull again? No, actually this time early. Okay, pistols again. I think those are different ones than I got in the previous tempo. Let's see. Also attack. When resonator dashes or dodges, increase attack by 4%. Okay, yeah, that could also work pretty well for her. Nice. Now, 70. If there's no 5 star in this one, then that means we go to pity. But there's actually a 5 star here, okay. And we got him. I already, already have him. So that's C1. But yeah, he seems like a cool guy. And he has pistols, so... Yeah, I have two 4 star pistols now, so I could build him. Even though I already have Chisha. Oh, is that a sword? Or is it under Claymore? I hope it's a sword. And there is the five star. <laughs> oh, so she is all about nature and flowers. Okay, I see. She's kind of the Nahida of this game. In a way. Okay, nice. Awesome. So that went pretty well. Okay, now the banner is gone, but this is actually fine. So now I basically just save the rest of my asteroid for Chinchi. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do now. Um, let's also see if that was actually a Foster sword. Or was it a clay? It was a sword. That is very nice. Attack percentage, good. Like that. Um, I could resonate against six stacks of oath upon entering the battlefield. Each stack increases attack by two percent. Okay, and then they lose stacks every two seconds, but also gain stacks when they defeat an enemy. Yeah, seems uh, not too complicated. Just hit hard, kill enemies, basically. <laughs> so not only did I get a constellation for Sunwa, but I also got a Forster pistol. Actually, two Forster pistols, Forster gauntlets. And a Forster Sword. That is exactly what I wanted. This is everything that I was asking for at the beginning of the video. Honestly, that couldn't have gone any better. I mean, technically it could have gone better if I had gotten even more Sunra constellations, but honestly, I'm not gonna complain about this. There's literally nothing to complain about here. I could have also gotten just zero Sunras and zero Forster Swords and so on. So yeah, I just see this as an absolute win. I'm happy with how the session went. So I guess now I have to level up those new weapons. And then my characters are gonna be even stronger for the next few videos. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And yeah, have a nice day.